Yeah. Uh, Greybow's also going to be really good, but no demons, so I'll play Barov. The fireball thing, yeah. Do you ever take the Maxnet triple knowing we have high odds of getting another? I think that's just more actions that my poor brain needs to do. I, what I needed to do was sell the Bran and reborn the other Maxna and then end on selfless. That's what I really needed to do. But uh, but you can see this is just... Oh my god, it's so filthy. And the chance that you get going is incredibly high because you just stay on tier 1 and then you farm triples like crazy. Just farm triples. So you're you're almost guaranteed to get like two, three, four triples, if not more. That's a ghost. It's actually nice for us. Mm, this one is pure gamble. Gamba. Honestly, whichever one buys the Acolyte. <laughs> All right. <laughs> whichever one buys the Acolyte. Get him, Yash. Fuck him up. Fuck him up, Yash. One mech. Oh. That's an Acolyte. But that might be a puppy. If it's a mummy, I win. Hey, I win. Nice. Easy lucky. Easy lucky, baby. I'm gonna buy Acolytes to fill my buddy meter faster. Just be a house. General structure of some sort. This one, Hero Power, is way better than Alex, and they both leveled. They both have Acolytes. Uh, that's a shame. Okay, so it's a time, I think, right? Every time. Oh, she dealt zero to Deathwing. No, no, she has a Swabby. Or a War? Okay, that's fine. She just didn't play our unit. They, they both read as no type, but she dealt zero to the Ghost. Which means she was just holding her card. No. I think you always bet this guy anyway, but... Really Ghost turn is actually really bad for the buddy meter. Mummy and up. Don't think we stay versus a ghost. Just raise the levels a bit now. Farm, generally speaking, is stronger at this stage of the game. He ended up leveling because he fought the ghost. Mm. So his curve is a little off. I'll go Yashiraj then. Yashiraj has a nice curve here. Yashiraj gets to buy hero power, and Rafam gets to buy and hero power, but his hero power is weaker. If Rafam was still on one, I would vote Rafam. So yeah, Ghost is really bad for the buddy meter. It didn't fill up much. But we're winning our rounds. We're winning our bets, so that's good. Not gonna waste money here. Should be this one. The hero power provides tempo. And Nyashra should level this turn, I think. But we have time, I will wait. 40 seconds on the clock. I could triple coin to buy something here, but I don't want it. I should get my buddy in two turns anyway. So if Yashirash stays, it's a buy and a hero power. But this one is also staying, so... I'm just going to vote this one because they've got that uh, hero power to make them stronger. 
Unless I see them level last minute. See if we get there. You're doing great out there. Oh, they do have Acolyte. I thought they leveled. I should reposition for it. Might save me a damage. Probably saves me a damage if I do that. Yeah. Two damage. I think the attack guy is uh, better. Lost the bet, damn. Definitely going up. I didn't like that one either. Here's a gold for the trouble. So next turn I get my apprentice. Oh, I can actually save coins for this, right? So had I won my bets, I would have had three extra coins in the hand for this. Okay, that's good to know. I don't think it's bad what I did, right? Because buying Bronze Warden and leveling is really good. Uh, but I need to plan to try and have coins in my hand when I get this thing. So I can instantly double my coins. So here it might have been worth it to actually um, not buy the Bronze Warden and to keep the coins. And then I will have so much money to turn after. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be learning experiences on every hero. So many things to consider. Won the bet, triple is here. Alright, take our time. Apprentice for sure. Coin puts me to 10. Yeah, I mean, there's probably no reason not to, right? This feels already so broken. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's not broken at all. Definitely not broken. I can't wait to see this shake out. Little bit of a mega buster. Take the tank next turn. Could take the tank this turn. But don't have to play that actually. Alex on four. I'm gonna give it to this one then. I think I like the freeze. The tank seems pretty good. We just saw Millhouse. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, that doesn't mean that this is okay. You get over 10 gold. I, I'm not sure. I, I wasn't willing to try that. Who wants to go to six while buying a tank? But Shady, we don't have enough gold for that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I guess I coin roll, right? Because I want to be able to bet. I could roll one more time and upgrade. But do we feel strong enough? We're going to get Acolyted on the buster. So maybe try to get through Acolyte first. They put that little barrier there for the for the tier to five, but Barrow was like, "Oh, that's cute. Ten gold, is it?" <laughs> oh, Barrow doesn't care. Do they have their thing? That's the question. I 
I know that Reform's all in now. And Rag's more likely to chill a little bit more, so give it to Reform. I got shark bait. You can't just bomb my Frank. Unbelievable. Left, right. Take it. We're actually fine every time. Sweet. Farm holds the fort. Really their Happy with a mech roll for now. What's in and what's out? Yeah, I mean. I'm doing Murloc stuff if I have that opportunity, but I'm currently into Buster stuff. The buddy can go soonish, maybe next turn. It's definitely done enough work to be considered very, very good. Down a minion and up a goal. Playing these two, honestly, the buddy, let's see. Let's use our coins now and see how far we get. Probably buy this. Hmm. Let me actually just hold on the fish then. I'm looking at this. But it doesn't feel good enough I think you can win this thing. when I have this, but I'm not sure. Could lead with Buster. Don't have to lead with Apprentice. But I think she's out next turn. I think it's going to be really hard to... Actually, I guess it depends on where the buddy meter's at. Getting the extra triple could be good. Kangor's a bit far back. We're in dangerous territory. I should probably sell it. That's heartbreaking to see the Frank die like that. Oh, actually tying? Nice. Good job, team. I'll make a Golden Dong. I'll make a Golden Primal Fin. Could just continue going down this path. I'm gonna pass now. That's good, but not good enough for what I want to do. Beasts are out. It's been a little bit of a dry spell. Two deflectos and a fish. Yeah, I mean, I'm using all my coins because I'm uh, selling out of it. So I'm, I'm just going to use my money. Modules, perfect. Now I'll buy another fish if I see it. Two brands, but it's too late. Uh, it's out every time. Moduling this every time. This is out every time. I'm playing two of these. This is out. I should move up. It's probably just out for another thing. Okay, so was that a clean, clean turn? No, not really, right? But do we have a game plan? Yeah, we do have a game plan, so. Overall, I'm happy with it. No, it's not dead. I thought it would be almost impossible. It's taunted for the love of God, man. I think we're still fine. It's just kind of crazy, uh, especially with that hit. 
It's just like, how did, how is it alive at that point? Insane, man. Now I don't kill him harder. Oh my god. What happened? And I can use my coins here as well if I win. Yeah. Disgusting. Don't care about this. I feel like I might just go for a six and just. I just need to play. Golden Buster, Baron, Amul. <laughs> Do I care for Amul? Maybe another Buster. Uh -huh. Probably just rolling for Baron now. That's my main goal. Don't care about Dong. Just Baron. Better hire a recruit while you can. Nah, it should really always die. Let's be honest. That was a freak. That was a freak turn, right? Two buddies in play stack. Yeah, I'm not sure if I wanted to make board space for that. It's always something with you, isn't it? Why not triple the deflector with another one in shop? The only thing that's relatively useful is another buster, right? So why spend six gold buying it to maybe get something that I'm not selling straight away? Tripling needs to serve a purpose. You shouldn't triple for the sake of tripling. Which is usually in the end game, because in the early game tripling is almost always good, but in the end game, sometimes a triple is just a waste of gold. Like here, I triple this and I buy another one that's six gold for maybe getting this card. Or I can just use six gold to roll for Baron. Which seems way better. Now that I have the Baron, I'm not even sure if I'm playing this uh, other buster. Think about it for a second. Another golden buster. No. Just pity. Roll for golden Baron. Maybe Menace. Menace is actually kind of okay now. Better hire a recruit while you can. Whatever. I mean, I'm wasting my gold anyway. I'm gonna hold the buster for this round, I think. No, I'm actually out of a deflecto for this. Let's see if you can stay on top. You had five minions at the point? Sure, sure, sure. Let me go first, please. A big zap. It's not good enough. Deeper makes zap better against us. Mm. I guess that's kind of true. A uh, tie? What? Unbelievable. Alright, so what's the positioning here? A 
attack. They go first, they bump, bump. Get this reset. I, I kind of like this, actually. Roll it down for another Golden Buster. Normally I would want another Kangar, but I think my comp is probably just done. I could replace this with a Kangar, which is technically better. I guess if I see a Kangar, I get to think about it. Oh my god. Now I think I like the Buster more for the guaranteed buff. Are Quillbars in? Quillbars are in. Okay. I can coin and get the Menace. I'll just hero power and not freeze. I think I'm just rolling for this now, right? Uh, this guy was okay. You got this. You're way ahead. Large. We're big. We're bigger though. I think this is. It's just Golden Baron with uh, Golden Busters. Insane. My tokens are destroying him. My deflecto value trades without dying, without the shield. It's like he has a 93 damage whirly and we just don't care. So I think it's just gems and another golden buster. Rag lived, okay. I lost the bet. It's over. We're done. GG. I could theoretically cycle Deflecto to be able to put gems here. I could also buy it. Ooh, I kind of like that, actually. See, now tripling makes sense, because that's my last buster. And I need board space. Easy buster. What? Come on, game. <laughs> All right. Never lucky. Never lucky. All right. Here. If I win, I one shot him, right? So, no bet on them. If they go first, this positioning is better. If we go first, this positioning is better. But... Actually, no, this is always better, I think. No, it's not true. You might miss out on your golden, but they might win Fury or something. They're not big enough anyway. And the bomb is perfect like this. No, it's not. The selfless doesn't kill it. All right. It's still more than fine. More than fine. The tokens are just so large. Crazy. So humble to bet on them? Yeah. yeah. So yeah, Baroff seems uh, very broken as well. Not as broken as Millhouse, because you still need to win your bets, but man, if you win your bets, it's just... Huh, it's almost like having a bunch of extra money is really good. <laughs>